the things that I saw while I was down there were all Americanized stuff. Uh, the clubs yeah. were all discotheques, lighting. I mean, they focused more on that than they did on cultural stuff. Yeah. yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? The malls, all Americanized. You know, Mega Mall, mm -hmm. <laughs> right? I mean, all of that was all Americanized. Yeah. Everything was geared for American. But you go, and, and I tried to visit some of the cultural places. Even those were not as cultural as I thought it would should have been. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. All the Phil I thought I was going to have a hard time talking in the Philippines, you know, because I'm Everybody English. Everybody spoke English, yeah. Mm -hmm. I would try to say things in Tagalog, and they're laughing at me, and they would say it in English. <laughs> <laughs> Here I'm struggling, right? And I and I tell the story. I tell I tell the story a lot where I, I'm on a jitney, right? And I uh, and I had asked oh, my cousin, yeah. hey, how do I get on and off? And they say, oh, you got to say this. You got to yeah. say para or para. Right? Para, yeah, para. So I'm on there and I see my sub getting ready goes, oh, I don't like better, better. And the guys think I'm holding them up like I want money because I'm saying it wrong. Because para is yeah. money. Yeah. Para is You're lucky stuff. somebody didn't yeah, stab yeah. you. Right, man. well, that's yeah. why. And the guy says, oh, you mean you want to get off in English? I'm like, yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, like, God. you know what I mean? Yeah. But that's how it was. I mean, yeah. it was so Americanized there. Mm -hmm. You know, because American is what almost second language to them, right? I yeah, mean, they, they learn it in English. school. Yeah, because really? yeah, we, we learn. School. And I didn't know that, so yeah. I'm going there like a dumb American saying, uh, <laughs> "Excuse me, Paul, can how I?" How many How many Americans do you think learn to speak Spanish at, in high school Spanish class? Right. How many do you think? You don't 5%. need to answer. You, you don't. Yeah. <laughs> but 5%. in the Philippines, when they learn English in school, yeah. they can really. Speak yeah, speak, speak, speak way yeah. better yeah. English than I am. And Filipinos, they, and most they of the talk. ones I, I meet, uh -huh. they speak the dialect from their province, they speak the national language, Tagalog, and they normally can speak English, yeah. you know. And speak proper English. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, they're pretty <laughs> yeah, sharp yeah, people, and they don't, they don't take... I mean, I speak slang English. Yeah, they don't, they don't take <laughs> their education... Yeah. Uh, uh, for granted over there yeah, in over school there. you know right, going right, to school right, right. And, and and whatnot so yeah school is always number one yeah as poor as they are they will make sure that kid goes to school yeah you remember yeah. that i mean no matter what they had to do to get that kid to school they were going to school regardless mm -hmm. how poor they were wow yeah. yeah it was i mean that was the most important thing for any of them because once they got to school to work at mcdonald's in the philippines you have to have a college degree yeah. that's true yeah <laughs> Jollibee, you like Jollibee, right? Yeah. Jollibee, Sometimes. McDonald's. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You have to, you have to sell have Slady in the mall. Yeah. You have wow. to have a college degree. Yeah. You couldn't work there if you did not pass school. Yeah. Even yeah. janitor. Yeah. Even janitor in the mall or uh -huh. whatever, you have to have a college degree. Yeah. Yeah. Only yeah. now. Yeah. yeah. Only now that you can work even you don't have a college degree. Oh, now as it's, getting, you now it's getting Americanized. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah that, that's American. Now you can be an idiot like most Americans. <laughs> I, I didn't say it. He said it over there. I didn't say it. Dude, you know, we've been going for way over the hour. Oh, are we? Yeah. Oh, shoot. Hey, folks. As always, we never get do our hour shot here. Yeah, so we're uh, we've dead. already extended. Um, <laughs> so what we're going to do now, like we always love to do, we, like, we want to get a demonstration. Um, so we're going to have Mike show us uh, a couple of techniques. <laughs> <laughs> and then once that fails, we're gonna go to Jordan because Jordan is the guy at this point. Yeah. So oh. um, we're gonna be right back. We're right gonna back. Set, we're gonna, gonna set gonna up. Reset, so. <laughs> reset everything. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Welcome hey guys, welcome back. Um, so now, like we always, uh, we always allude to, uh, we're gonna have these guys do some demos <laughs> when we remember. <laughs> yeah, when we remember. And obviously, we we, we talked uh, Miguel, Ruby, Ruby. Mackenzie. To, to come and play with Naeem. You can call me Miggy. Miggy? Yeah. Miggy. Yeah. Miggy. Miggy. Yeah. Since, we're, since we're close. <laughs> <laughs> so you obviously there's another Miggy. name change. Yeah. <laughs> now there's a new name change. It's Miggy. Yeah. <laughs> so you guys have fun. Depending what county Try either. not to hurt him too badly because, you know, I need him for other things later. <laughs> yeah, we'll figure it out. So, uh, a little bit of Dos Epades and, and how does this play out in, 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 in stick works, which... Uh, uh, we have our sticks, our scream of sticks from FMA Supply that we're going to be using. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to work we're going to work off of um, off of options off of the arm throw. Okay. So the basic arm throw is here. I'm going here. Boom. He goes down. Oh, I think we need to do that again. <laughs> yes. Yeah, because we have to go this way. 
different anvil. So, are you all right? <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> many times the throw is taut like this, with a big wide step, and the guy goes down. But you don't have to do that. Direct. <laughs> Can you feel it on your bicep? Oh, yeah. <laughs> It twists yeah. right here. Now, did you feel the difference between when I stepped wide and throw? Oh. Yeah. That one, it felt like you were pulling my arm yeah. and then you were leveraging. This one, you're leveraging Directly. up. And it down. Almost down. It's almost Straight like you're, down. you're cutting into it. Yeah. I'm kind of pushing it to the side because right. I'll show you off the camera. But <laughs> the way it normally is, there's no room to fall. You get smashed. Oh, so, yeah, let's not do that one. <laughs> so, so the next is when I go to grab this, you're going to counter. Then I go here. I got to be ready for the counter. Oh. Those are two options. One more time. Go here. Up. Oh. Oh. Fell out. Okay. The next one. Uh, I think all styles have this. After you block, you counter check and snake. This arm. Counter. <laughs> There's the disarm. No, don't fall. Uh, it felt like I had to. No. No. <laughs> if I didn't That's fall, a disarm. If I didn't fall, it felt like my wrist was going to pop out of place. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jordan. Jordan. Jordan, you do this. This guy's fear. He's a daredevil. Uh, I held on too long. <laughs> so the counter for this is to relieve this pressure, right? Did right, you feel the back. pressure when I got to this? And That's I was gonna roll. Fell. I'm yeah. gonna roll my boat. But Jordan's wise. He don't. He don't want me to get to this. So there's the counter to that. Oh, I see. One more time, slowly. I step. Another option. Here, look at your shoes. Go down, turn, oh. oh. All right. Dead, I'm okay. Do one more time. I'm really Go. glad that was pending on me. Here, yeah. right there, down. When you see his body get like that, chicken wing. Step. In the shoulder. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, <I can. laughs> One more. Down. Turn. It's painful. I hate seeing that. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. yeah. So. That's the first one uh, was the arm throw. This one is working on the snake coming off of the snaking disarm. Mm -hmm. The last series I'll show you is uh, is working off of trapping disarm. Trapping disarm is where we counter. And we're gonna disarm from here. Okay. So this is the disarm. I go here. If I don't get it, I go back. I'm not getting it here. I fire it back the other way. See? Again. Because this guy is very wise, he's going to counter me. He's going to slap my stick off. Counter. Ooh. And then I get it back again. So, of course, in a scream up from Cebu, the way they tell me is they don't want. They don't want to let, they want to touch your weapon, but they don't yeah, want to touch you. And the, the, the people I met, they, they always say a, a good player will never let you touch their check hand. Yeah. Oh yeah. So that's, that's the worst. <laughs> you let the other player touch your empty hand. So you try it, try it. No, you try it. Okay. This. Come here. Don't change your footwork. Okay. Go back. Oh, this way. That way. Uh -huh. Check here. Check here. Okay. Yeah. If you don't get it, throw right. your elbow back this way. Ah, uh, oh, okay. Yeah. 
you know. Huh. Yes. So from here to here. Yes! Okay. Wow. That is strong. Yeah, good. I was trying to get some resistance. <laughs> so now, uh -huh. what you want is, you want to, what? Oh, I want to get this out of the way. Here. Oh, here. Yeah. Oh, that's where that happens. Yeah. Then you go here. Ah. Ah. Oh, it's slow. Whew. One more time. If you touch my stick, uh -huh. knock it down, or slap it down, then, then I go here. Insert. <laughs> right, wait, 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 go back to that, go back to that, go back to that. Because I want to, I want to, I want to show the camera where that happens. Okay? Is that not down? Slap it off. Go in, insert. Yeah, turn, turn, turn. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Now, if, if the one attacking is wise, yeah. they won't let you touch their stick right. slowly. I'm going to... Counter, when I go to get the disarm, bang! Hit. The hit is there. Bang! And then you can still go. And everything's there. Yeah. yeah. So that distraction then becomes a big part of the idea of making sure you never get touched. It's, it's pretty tough to disarm somebody or throw them uh -huh. without hitting them first. Okay. I mean, See, you heard it first. Okay, you hard. heard it first. You have to hit the guy first. Well, dude, oh that God. was amazing. I never thought you could move like that. And I've you said you're not at your yeah, best right I've now? I've never seen Jesus him move like this. Right. It's crazy. So, this is the dos yeah. Yes. Yeah, about. This is what I... Uh, these are some of the things I've learned uh, in yeah. practicing dos Where Where the curriculum does this, does this start to play into? into yeah, when, the, when basic. A beginner. Basic. Well, the, the basic disarming... Uh -huh. When a beginner starts, the first is striking disarm. Oh, with the form. Chapping disarm. Snaking. Snaking disarm. Those are the three basic disarms that if somebody walks in the door, signs up, they're gonna get they'll that. be learning that in their first two months. Oh, wow. man. That's, That's intense. cool, yeah. Yeah. So, um, I love this stuff. Yeah. But now, let, let's turn to Yao Yang, because we oh, know good. Jordan yeah. is the guy. I want you to get a little bit of rest. Yeah. Start yeah, you look yeah. like you're, you drank too much water. Get some water. <laughs> <laughs> you're not, around, you're not sweating. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Jordan, come on in here. Uh, you want me to hold the pads for you? No, we're going to let Naeem do it, because I want to see Naeem feel that, that brunt of that. Naeem, what am I holding? Naeem, put that leg pad on. All right, so this is Jordan. <sighs> um, Jordan is going to really get to... Beat the crap out of Naeem. Let's let's hope he doesn't hurt him. No, the leg pad. Oh, the leg pad. Where's that? Oh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. This is. Put a... your foot on your left leg. <laughs> this is yeah, gonna hurt. There you go. And this. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be pretty. Big. This is gonna be. Uh... Do you want to send flowers or donations to Naeem's death? <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate it. I'll miss. I'll make sure that he gets the flowers. I'll keep the cash. <laughs> All right, so Jordan, what are you going to show us in, in this? <laughs> um, I'm going to show the basic strikes of the Yao Yan. It's The strike is similar to Scrim. Uh -huh. But the strikes we have, it's not similar. It's a Scrim strikes, but translate to our Scrim strikes. Right. The forearm. The forearm. So okay. that becomes a stick. Yeah, and then becomes sticks. And then, of course, I'm going to follow up a kicks. Yeah. You know, <laughs> if you make him scream like a girl, I'll give you twenty dollars. Stop telling people that. I like. I, I, no, I mean, hey, it's what I do. You haven't paid a single one so of folks them. folks, have fun with he this. He won't pay it. you. <laughs> this is gonna okay. Hold the pads uh, like this. Yeah. Okay. Like that, and then support with the other one. You know, okay. Support. Here. Yeah, like that. So I'm gonna show you is the downward strike, or we call it hatao in Yaoyan, in Yaoyan Ardigma. It's a downward strike. It's like in the stick, there's a downward. What number is this? I don't know what's eleven. Number. number eleven in Dos Pares. So but I'm gonna use it both of my hands. So the first one is left, right, left, right. Four strike. Okay. Jesus and then you Christ. hold it this. You hold it this. Okay. Right here. The first follow-up after that is the turning, or we call it roscas. You hit it right here, then the other one, and this way. Okay? Then one, two, three, four, one, two. And then the follow-up is this one. Switch your steps. Yeah. 
Ready? You okay? Ah! <laughs> I need a raise. <laughs> does, that, does that work the 25? You're screaming like a girl. I'm waiting. Jesus I got Christ. Right. <laughs> so it's. Stop. <laughs> and that's true. I know. So if that's only shin the leg and you're not a uh, kick fighter. Okay, folks, you, you saw my leg buckle the way it did, right? He'll slow mo if he needs to later on, so you guys can see my leg buckle. He's going easy on me. <laughs> this is speed. This is not even hard, which we're not gonna do, by the way. <laughs> we're not gonna do. So you translate the the essentially what we would call hammer fist here in the states. Right? Yeah, well, you can see this one and. Uh, oh yeah, they call it hammer okay. fist or yeah. It's like this. That's the one. We're using the forearm. We're not using the bottom fist or the okay. back fist. Why always use the forearm? Because this is our sticks. In Ardigma, this is our sticks. In Yawian. So how do you train them? Because you have to have pretty You have hard. to condition um, your forearm in the traditional Yawian bag. Uh, which yeah. looks what is that's just that's a abaca rope and cord yeah it's yeah. a abaca rope it's a we call manila it rope. manila, manila rope. rope we call it here manila uh -huh. rope. yeah Damn, so that's, that's the other thing crazy. with it they show up to the training camp they didn't have heavy bags that looks like a log they had to make their own bags from logs and raw material did you make those yeah yeah Both dude them. folks these bags and we'll show them in a little bit but they're what uh, eight feet tall yeah. How much do they weigh? The other one's maybe 315 and this one maybe around 180, 170. 180, that's a light bag, is one 180 pounds. Yeah, but that's that yeah. yeah, yeah, so yeah, folks, come just take a look at these bags. He made those bags himself. Go. Out of rope. Yeah. What's inside of them? Old clothes. Old clothes. <laughs> Let's see. So, oh this is how we God. condition our forearm, even our shin, you know? You just go like that. Yeah. And then it's just until, until you get used to it, and then later on, it's gonna be nothing. The same thing in the round house. Or... You hit it with your shin. That's how we condition our, our strikes. Folks, it feels like a tree. I swear, if you were to touch this, yeah, th that what he did right now would hurt most people. Uh, try it out. Uh, try the other one. Yeah, try the other one. Ah. This is soft. Keep it down. Keep it down. Keep that, soft. Keep that one as hard as you can. First time. Don't even touch it. Just. Can you feel your bend? Uh, can you feel your bone bend? Ah. I'm gonna do it again. Wait, wait. Don't touch yourself. Yourself. Yeah. Okay, I'm done. Yeah, <laughs> uh, uh, there's three weaves on this. There's piña, banig, and then if you look here, I'll turn it to you. The words yaoyan are woven into that bag. Can you see it? That's crazy. <laughs> yaoyan woven. Right. Okay, so let me get back into this. To say that you guys still have a lot of traditional ways of training is is, is an understatement. Because I think my shin is gonna hurt for the rest of the week. <laughs> Dude, oh thank you guys so much for having us uh, you, visit your school. Thank, 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 thank you. This is so much there. fun. No, thank you for having me. Oh my god. god. Dude, that was some crazy stuff that I just watched. Dude, his light, just the light punches that he did. Well, if no, I didn't I'm, I'm referring more to what Mike oh, was showing. Yeah. I've yeah. never seen Mike move. And well, just always see. sit in the Right, table. he's always sitting in the table. <laughs> you guys are selling you, yeah. you guys have yourself. He's always a typical yeah. Filipino guy, big belly, instructor guy, he's just hanging out. But to see you move, and you're saying you're sick and you just got yeah, from surgery, 
and just see you just go and you look so comfortable. I haven't practiced the screamo in seven years. So folks, your first time in seven years you got to see Mike play. Well, I started two months ago. I, Did you? I wow. teach the Saturday Did class here. Okay. Uh, uh, Noon to one thirty. Noon to one thirty. Okay. okay. Yes. Wow. Yes. Wow. Yes. The restrictions yeah. are so. Yeah. <clears throat> Again, let's give the address to the place and also the uh, the internet information for online uh, FMA supplies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the equipment uh, is FMA Supply dot net, okay. and we will be giving the ten percent off code uh, to Cuyo Rico and Naim, brother Naim. And, uh, All right. So let's buy some six today. <laughs> <laughs> the code for us to put oh, on the. No, no. I know the code. He's going to tell me. Don't, don't give us the code, yeah. <laughs> and then our gym is located in Rancho Cordova. Uh, we're at 10473 Folsom Boulevard, Rancho Cordova, California, 95670. And this is the Rancho Cordova Martial Arts Center. Yes. We propagate Filipino martial arts. Well, well, folks, this we've been on here for about almost an hour and a half, so <gasps> this is Kali Conversation with me, Rick, me, Nate, and our very special guest, Jordan. I don't even know his last what name. What is your last name? This is called an Abuyo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Jordan it is. <laughs> and our very good Michael, friend. Michael, Miguel, Ruby, Miggy. Miggy. Yeah. Miggy. Yeah. 